The Central Coast Local Health District aims to provide all patients with the safest possible care. This video gives information about patient safety while in hospital. Please share this information with your family or carers. Staff will always try to include you and your family in planning your care. Whether you are a patient, a family member or carer of a patient, or are booked to come into hospital soon, there are things staff should be made aware of to help provide safe care. Please tell staff if you need an interpreter. If you identify as being Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander, if you are a carer for someone and that person needs care while you are in hospital. Tell staff what medications you have been taking at home, including any herbal or over-the-counter medications and vitamins, and of any side effects you may have had. Also let staff know if you have had any type of blood products before and if you had any reactions. Make it known if you need a special diet or have a food allergy. You should also let staff know if you have a problem swallowing. Please give staff any copies of advanced care planning documents that you may have prepared, such as an advanced care directive. While you are in hospital, please let us know if there is something you do not understand and ask questions if you need more information. Being in hospital can be stressful for some patients who are known to become anxious, agitated or confused. Our top five program enables family and carers to share tips and strategies to help staff provide care that best suits the patient. Please ask for more information about the top five program. In hospital, you will be given a white armband with your details on it. This band will be red if you have any known allergies or reactions. Let staff know if any information about you needs to be changed. While in hospital, there are things all patients can do to keep safe. To help prevent infections, wash your hands before and after going to the toilet and before eating. You can also remind staff and visitors to clean their hands before and after contact with you. Avoid touching any wounds, drips or drains that you may have. Most patients will receive medication while in hospital. Be aware that staff will ask your name and check your identity band before giving you any medication. Some medications can be harmful if taken together, so it's important not to take any of your own medications in hospital, unless told otherwise by staff. Falls can happen in hospital when you are feeling sick or taking certain medications. If you need help moving or walking, please ask the staff and wait for their assistance. Take time when you get up from bed and let staff know if you feel sick or unsteady. Wear comfortable non-slip shoes or slippers. If you are unable to wear or do not have such footwear, speak to staff about other options. Eat and drink as advised by staff. This will help you get better sooner. If your family, carers or friends want to bring food from home, Please ask staff first as this may not be a safe option for you at this time. Pressure injuries, also called bed sores, are damage caused to the skin often by lying or sitting in one place for too long. To stop bed sores, it's important to keep changing your position. Call staff if you need help. Also, to stop blood clots, move your legs if possible when in bed or sitting. It is important for you to spend time sitting out of bed, especially at meal times. You may also need to wear special firm stockings, and it is important to walk as much as your condition allows. You may have pain as part of the reason you came to hospital. The staff will ask if you have pain. Tell staff where the pain is and how it is making you feel. Ask staff about what to expect and ways to manage your pain. If you, your family member or carer, are worried that you are becoming more unwell, talk to your nurse or doctor caring for you first. If you are still worried, a REACH call can be made. Please ask for more information about the REACH program. 
A senior staff member will respond to the call and get extra help if needed. When it is time to go home, ask your nurse to explain any changes to your medications, as it is important to take all medications as recommended. Let staff know if a medical certificate is needed and ask who to contact if you have any questions or worries when you go home. Please be aware that you may be transferred to the discharge lounge to wait to leave hospital. In most cases, you will need to arrange for someone to take you home. The information in this video can help keep you safe while in hospital. Information about your healthcare rights can be found on the Australian Commission on Safety and Quality in Healthcare website and in patient care areas.